Hello beautiful people, welcome back to my channel. It's Queen Gleets. You're welcome back to my channel today. If you are new on this channel, thank you so much for clicking on this video. And if you are not new, thank you for always returning. I appreciate you guys. Thank you so much. Today guys, I want to tell you how to use your oils properly. How to use your oil serum, especially the milk ones. There's this perception that your oils that comes in the milk you should look, you know, like your skin free milk, glitter C, glitter tiny comprime, and the lights, they are very, very active. Yes, it is true. They are very, very, very active. But they are not meant to be used directly on your skin. I observed a lot of people uh, rub it on their skin directly. It is not meant to be rubbed on the skin directly. If you keep rubbing your glutathione comprime fort on your skin directly, your glutase, your magic dama, your zuni, aqua butin, all those uh, serums that lose their milk. See, this is what I'm talking about this morning. Okay, for us to really understand what I'm talking about clearly, this one is glutathione serum, uh, glutathione comprime fort. So as you can see, it's like milk, right? It's like milk. This is Gluta C, Gluta C intense whitening. This one, it's also like milk. It's not a plain serum. We also have Magic Dharma, okay? So these are the lights of oil serum, milk serums I'm talking about. This one is called Zuni. This is very very active. This is a very 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 active serum. I also love. This is called Zuni. As you can see, they are all like milk they are not plain oil serum like your kojic sun your glutathione serum excuse me guys your kojic sun serum your glutathione serum uh those ones like your nano uh, um, africa serum x x y after serum you see those ones they are like plain serum they are like colorless okay they are not like this milky one so i'm not talking about those ones today i'm talking about these particular ones that lose like milk they are all very very active serums whitening sharp sharp whitening serum but they are not meant to be rubbed on the skin directly so if you love to use your milk serum on your skin how do you use it you need to dilute it, okay? For example, I'm using this one. I'm using my glutathione comprime um, milk. That's the reason why you hear people say, I use glutathione comprime, I'm experiencing visible, visible vein. Visible vein. Your vein is in your skin, but if you do what will bring it out, if you do what will make it more visible, it's going to be more visible, okay? So, how do you avoid that? Then, this is where we are going to be using this my jojoba oil this jojoba oil okay uh this jojoba oil is one of my favorite carrier oil too that i love is see how, how plain it looks very 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 plain pure and clean so i love using my jojoba oil so much what you can do is you can take like your own dread l mail of jojoba oil depending on the quantity if you are using for yourself then you don't need to use too much okay you can take like 100 ml of your jojoba oil and then if I'm working with my glutathione comprime serum, I can pour in half of this, okay? If you are also working with your glutathione, you pour half. If you are working with your zuni, you pour half into your 100 ml serum. And if you want to mix, uh, if you want to mix your milk together, like you want to combine, so you have to use your tablespoons measurement. You are not going to use half, half, half. You are going to be using tablespoon measurements like uh, three tablespoons, three tablespoons, three tablespoons to complete. And then you mix it in your over oil, okay? Or any carrier oil you choose to use. This is one of my own favorites I love to use. And then you shake it together and be using the days that you are not going to be using your whitening cream. The day you are not going to use your whitening soap, uh, the day you're not going to use your whitening cream, okay? 
Yes, so then you can now use this one. You can use this to your whitening oil, this is your whitening milk, all right? And then you see that it will never and ever give you visible green vein. But if you continue applying it directly on your skin, guys, you are writing letter to green vein and it will surely come. Your green vein will become very visible, your skin will become very light. Even though you you'll be lightening, your skin will become whiter, you will start lightening out. But you must experience that visible vein. And what's, what's the essence of lightening, yellowing, and then you, your, this is, your veins are becoming visible? It's not make it look pleasant, it's not make it look fine. So guys, that's how you can make use of your whitening, whitening milk serums without you applying directly on your skin and if you like you want to drop some few essential oils that you like yes you can also drop your essential oil sandalwood is very perfect turmeric is also very perfect because they are all anti-inflammatory oils okay so they can help to remove any form of irritation and also prevent it so guys this is my video today this is just to help some of us i see i see a lot that many people do apply this or is this mills on their skin directly it is not meant to be rubbed on your skin directly okay you can dilute it with your uh carrier oils and let it do its work perfectly so it's going to have time to work into your bloodstream and do its work perfectly and then it is not meant to replace the whitening cream after all so the, the days you're not going to be using your whitening cream you can use this the days you not use your uh this then you use your whitening cream so thank you for watching my video today please stay tuned to this channel if you have not subscribed please subscribe to this channel join this winning family and let's win together take good care of yourself guys bye